Hi everyone. So as you know, I got this the other day as an early Christmas gift. And I'm going to try this out today on wet hair. I just got out of the shower a little bit ago. Um, as you can see, it has these little buttons on it right here. And this one has a fan symbol. And this one has several settings. And then this one is red, which symbolizes heat. And then you can see that this is the on switch. And this has a blue dot, which symbolizes the cool shot button. And then this side is the side you hold away from you. And this is where the heat comes out at. And then it comes with several of these attachments. I don't know what the difference is between the two that look just like this. I'm going to take this sticker off. I don't even know why there's stickers on this stuff. Ugh, very sticky. Um, but these are magnetic. And they fit on just like that. They're very cool. That's a really strong magnet. Um, I haven't tried this out yet. Um, so I'm going to test it right now. I turn it on. Whoa, that's pretty strong, and this is on the lowest setting. Let me blow my stuff down. And so, if you can see it right here, I don't know if it's picking it up. There's a one red dot, and you hit it twice. There's two red dots. And you can hit it a third time. There's three red dots, and it's very, very so I'm going to turn that back down. And then I have one purpley dot here. Two. And three. Oh my gosh, looks like you're in a windstorm almost. That's just crazy. Wow. 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 That's actually the coolest heat that there is, and it is pretty cool, but you can also do the cool shot, and it does cool down really fast. It'll be cool if you take away all the dots, so I'm going to go ahead and, oops, I'm going to go ahead and put this on it and see what kind of difference it makes. So now it's just centralized right here. There is... There is this neat thing here to clean. Um, it's the filter. And you should always make sure that's cleaned out. You don't want to have your hand on it down here, so you have to center your hand here. And you can feel when you're holding it. It's, you know, you want to hold it right here, otherwise it'll tip. If you hold it down here, it just won't feel the same. So it's centered in your hand right here, and it's even weight. It's not really any lighter than a regular hair dryer that it feels like anyway. Um, it's just a different type of handle it seems like, you know. I gave my other one to my mom already because she needed a hair dryer. Um, so I can't compare like next to each other. But I'm going to go ahead and try this out. And I'm going to set it on the medium setting. <laughs> Medium fan and medium heat. That way I'm not burning myself. That high heat could burn me. This is so hot. already starting to feel dry on the top layer. It's supposed to be better for your hair somehow.
them are too hot for me. I'm gonna turn up the fan one more. As you can see, my hair is very thin. It dried really fast. I mean, it's not completely dry yet. I'm just going to take my tangle teaser and go through my hair. My hair gets very knotty with any hair dryer pretty much. But it doesn't feel as tangly, I wouldn't say. I'm still getting hair, of course, out when combing. Um, I mean, as you can see, my hair looks pretty dry. Um, not completely, and that was only, what, three minutes. I'm used to blow drying my hair for up to 20 sometimes with a regular hair dryer. So this is pretty amazing. Um, I don't know if I have more shine or... It almost looks like I might have more shine. I don't know, what do you guys think? Does it look like my hair is more shiny than normal? Have you tried it? What do you think of it? This, my friends. $400. I really do think that is too high of a price for a blow dryer. However, it is a Dyson. And I think they have a really great idea in this. Just can't see spending four hundred dollars on this. Um, I'm only used to you know fifteen to twenty dollar hair dryers my whole life um, from Walmart, you know Revlon or whatever brand is cheap. So <laughs> the thought that he went and bought this for me and it was so expensive, I'm just baffled. I'm putting it to the test for you guys and. I'm going to continue testing it out. This is the only blow dryer I have now. Ooh, and that is still really warm. Um, this is the only blow dryer I have at the moment now. So I don't have anything else to test it to or compare it to at the moment. Um, oh, and it also came with this for the counter. You lay it on the counter and it won't slide off. And I don't know what this is. I don't know if you can see it. Let's see. To unplug it. It has like this, it's not a battery pack, but it's like a power pack on it. It's kind of strange. It has some fancy stickers. You can call them anytime. They have a website. Um, you can contact them and talk to them about anything. Um, the plug-in. It's just typical. Has the two buttons reset and test. It did come with the curling attachment, the I forgot what it's called, the diffuser for the curls. 
you have really curly hair, you can curl it much faster. Um, I think it, it gives you a lot more heat on this, but with this, you can do strand by strand without blowing yourself to pieces. <laughs> um, because, yeah, that, that was a windstorm. <sighs> and I just knocked over my makeup bag with that. That's how strong it is. <laughs> um, so I don't know, you tell me, would you buy something like this at this price? Or are you waiting for it to come down in price? Um, is healthier, shinier hair worth it to you? Um, is heat damage a big problem to you? Um, it has for me, I don't know if it's really heat, but I did color my hair this past summer and it is damaged on the ends. I did last week get a hair trim and it is still very much damaged. So I'm going to have to go in for regular regular trims and keep getting that cut away. Um, I'm just going to let it grow out now. And I try not to use a blow dryer every day because I don't have to dry my hair fast every day. Um, I don't have a job I go to during the week. I am a stay-at-home wife. So it's not something I have to do. I do like to dry my hair. Um, before going out, of course, so if I will be going somewhere, I do dry it. So I want to say about three or four times a week I might dry it. So I'm going to see if this thing helps my hair become healthier or just less frizzed or damaged. Um, I did regular condition and wash in the shower. And my hair feels a lot smoother. I don't know. I don't think there's anything too different, but I think there might be a little more smoothness. I don't know. It might take a couple tries to actually see see if it does anything that great. <laughs> but it was really shocking to get this as a gift. I had no idea he was buying it for me. Um We've both watched um, people online review these and thought it was neat and I kind of wanted one and I've talked about it a little bit, but I never thought that I would actually own one. <laughs> and now I do. So here's to Dyson and better hair. And no, I was not paid to do this review for you. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, let me know down below. My heater just came on, so that's why my hair is blowing in the wind. And you guys have a great day. I hope your Thanksgiving was great, and I will see you next time.